How's it going guys? It's me Simon, this is my walkthrough for the fitness center and how to defeat the swimmer ghost in Luigi's Mansion 3, so let's begin. So guys, we're on level 13 of the fitness center, two levels away from completing the game. So once we head on through to the next room, this is where all of the action begins. So head over to this door. Why not take a drink from the water fountain first? But if we press X at the door, it shows we need a key. And then a volleyball gets smashed into the glass window. So we go over and investigate, press X, and we can see the swimmer ghost. He's just there bouncing a volleyball between his pecs. I can't do that. And then after that, the purple ghost appears, the creepy ones. If you hoover him up, smash him into the wardrobe and defeat him, a key will pop out. And that will bring us into the next little room. So in the next room, we have these lockers. You can shoot a plunger, hoover it up and smash it. And then some ghosts will fly out. We've got gold ghosts and then miniature versions of the normal ghosts, which are quite cool. So you've got the mini blue ones and then the red ones, which like to ram you. The ones with full of rage. Once you've defeated them, just continue on down the stairs. So guys, it's time to hit the gym. Inside here, we've got two red block ghosts, one lifting weights, another one on the punching bag. We need to do it in this order. We need to lure the punching ghost into the center of the room where the cracks are. And we need to time it so that the weightlifting ghost throws a weight onto his head. One of the weight this, like this, so that it stuns him. And then you flash him with your torch. There we go. Then you flash him with your torch and then hoover him up and take him out. And then it's time to take out the weight ghost, go over to him, flash him with the torch, hoover him up and take him out. But there's actually a third red block ghost in this room. So hoover up one of the punching gloves, boxing gloves, aim at the punch bag, and then out appears the third red ghost. And to defeat this third ghost, just wait for him to ram at you and dodge his attack so he trips over himself, flash him with the torch, hoover him up, Crash, bang, wallop, take him out. And then we can head on into the next room, which is full of treadmills and cycles. So put on your favorite jams, head over to the boom box, flash it with your torch. Raise the roof. <laughs> there you go. And then head over to the treadmill. Press X on the treadmill, and then you try and stay on the treadmill. But this isn't actually the right one, so I just fell off anyway. The correct treadmill we need to go to is on this side, the closest one, the third one. And we need to run, stay on this treadmill and not fall off. And then we'll be rewarded with some gold and also a key so that we can enter the next room. There's also a spider on the ceiling if you want to take him out. For speed purposes, I missed it. I guess that's what they will say. And then enter the next room. In this room, you need to match the mats with how the posters are appearing on the wall. Not as if they are reflected, but as, as they are. So you see that the one on the wall is flat, the top one, and then the bottom one on the right hand side is folded up. So just like that, they all match. You just slide the mirror along the wall to see which the posters are showing and then you get the secret compartments so walk on through and then we're outside on a ledge that's collapsing so we need to run fast before Luigi falls to his death and at the end there is a treasure chest with a key so take that and then we're gonna have to gently maneuver our way across that's a pretty high fall if he fell but he won't fall I think okay once you've made it back to the edge, we can enter the next room. So once you head back to the other room, you can see you can actually explore the other side and get some treasure or head to the door. And it reveals that there were actually ghosts inside here doing yoga while you're moving their mats. And I think they're pretty annoyed. So you're gonna have to take them out. So let's start with this big red one, flashing with a torch, hoover them up. You can slam him into the other ghost. I like how the three red ones are just on top of each other looking like Goombas. So after defeating so many ghosts, lifting weights, punching the punch bag and on the treadmill, 
we're gonna need a shower. So in this room, head over to the showers. Don't use Luigi like what I did. Use Luigi, press ZL and it'll turn the taps clockwise and turn off the shower and make it less steamy inside here so you can see all the ghosts. But it is quite funny that Luigi is just turning off people's showers. Or creepy. Either way, turn off the showers and then take out the ghosts, they're just normal ghosts, flash them with the torch, hoover them up. If you can, just slam them into the other ones, make it easier. Well, faster as well. And then a creepy purple ghost will appear later on after you defeated those three. So take him out as well. And there you go. We're heading into the next room and we're ready for the boss battle. As soon as we enter the room, we're getting attacked by volleyballs. So for this battle against the swimmer ghost, we need to hide behind scoreboards, barriers and clocks. So what we need to do is to hoover up our own volleyball, wait for him to attack. When he misses, shoot your volleyball at him in his chest and that will stun him. And then bring out Guiji. We need to sneak Guiji around through this fence on the left hand side. So hide him behind this treadmill thing first until the next time, hoover up another volleyball and then shoot him in the chest, stun him and then make Guiji run it around to this pillar, hide there and then wait for the next time where you can stun the swimmer ghost again and then use Guiji to reach the switch and he can hoover it up with ZR so that goes all the way to empty and that will empty the pool. So now with the pool emptying it's easy for us, we're just going to take him out in a minute once the water's cleared, but he's like being flushed down like he's going down the toilet or something down the sink. He actually will get stuck in the plug and then we'll go down and enter the pool. So there he is, he's stuck now. We go into the pool and we can finish him off. All you need to do is hoover up a volleyball, aim for his head, boom. Head on over, don't do what I did and try to hoover him up, we need to flash him first, don't know why I did that, and then hoover him up, and then slam him, and boom, he's going down with a fight but he's just not strong enough for us. So there you go guys, that is how you defeat the swimmer ghost and we will retrieve the next elevator button number 14. So there you go guys, if you enjoyed this video, check out some more of my videos to help support my channel or consider subscribing for more content like this. I'm Simon from LOG, Level 1 Gamer, until next time, peace out. If you're having trouble leaving this level against this tongue thing, all you need to do is bring out Guiji and Hoover's tongue with both of them and then press A.